back in 2014, Paul and Sully came to the Passive House Open Days up at Steel Farm. Afterwards, we got talking uh, about this project that they wanted to create for themselves. They'd, you know, they'd got a barn, they'd converted a barn next door, but it wasn't living up to their expectations and they wanted to create where we are now into their forever home. So that started a five-year conversation about how to create that home and how to build it. Shepherd's Barn is the northeast's first passive house anything. What that means is it's been designed to minimise the amount of energy that's used for space heating and hot water, whilst also providing a very high standard of thermal comfort both in the summer and in the winter. So how are you, how are you finding living in the house? I'm really, really happy. I think it uh, just feels very comfortable. Um, the links to the outside really enjoy. So it's like, you know, the terrace is like an extra room, which we use a lot. Air quality is fantastic. You know, the light is good. We use all aspects like the west side, we come out and sit here and have meals quite frequently. We've got a sunken area on the south side that we can go if there's strong south westerlies coming in. So it sits in the environment really well. It's not a massive house and I wouldn't want a massive house. It's plenty big enough when we have the family round, but it's also not so big when there's the two of us there. It's very easy to live in. It's comfortable. We know it uses very little energy, which is the big thing. That's what we really wanted, was a house that didn't use much energy, and we know it doesn't. Well, we're, we're completely self-sufficient, so we've got zero energy costs. We're actually exporting yeah. to the grid. So really, we only have a couple of radiators on for a few hours a day for a few months of the year. 